the end of the game. It was a good game. It was a good game. A little, a little heartbreaking a little bit. From the play calls, um, a lot of two-point conversion. Three two-point conversions that was failed. And why he just didn't take the field goal? Like, Harvest kept wanting to get the two-point. I understand going all out and playing aggressive, but it's like, dude, take the points while you can. And he didn't want to take it. Like, literally, he didn't want to take it. This game possibly could have went to overtime. Again, like last year. But Harv's kept going on a two-point conversion. I know we probably see them again in the playoffs. But um, this game, I, I say this game cost was on Harv's. Harv's and a couple of plays on the defense because he the defense gave away a lot of bombs. Um, I was expecting the defense to have – to have um, Earl Thomas, you know, in the back just to prevent the big throws, but they were blitzing him on a couple of plays, and they had Tony Jefferson in the back, and we all know Tony Jefferson is not a real good cover guy. And this last play right here, when, when they got the first down, Tony Jefferson was in the picture. Um... Wide receivers not getting open. And then they started finally getting open when it was just a hurry up and play and just kind of like um, just like audible type of plays where they caught the defense winded. The run game was on point. I don't know why we just didn't slow the game down. It seemed like the game plan was just to try to have Lamar go pass for pass for Patrick Mahomes. And I'm like... Lamar is a decent passer on this one. He he passed pretty bad. I give him that. A, a lot of over overthrown plays, but the wide receivers wasn't like burning nobody. They weren't wide open. Um, the tight ends did their thing, you know. Uh, a lot of tilt passes. Uh, offensive line got beat tremendously, missing blocks. Uh, they showed Orlando Brown. He missed about two or three blocks. It's like, dang. Like, come on, y'all. Give Lamar a little time. And they gave him a little time, and he did his thing. But for as Lamar's um, overthrowing a couple of plays, that was on him. But a lot of it, I say, was offensive line. We should have just slowed the game down. Just run the ball, run the ball. When we started running the ball, that's when we started getting our points. Mark Ingram had three t rushing TDs. Lamar rushed for one. Embarrassed the old dude on that one with that spin. But remind me of his high school play. But hopefully they can learn a lot from this. Um, and if we do play Kansas City again in the playoffs, we would have Jimmy Smith back, so that's a plus. Because we do need it. We we missed him today. Like I seen Maurice Kennedy, which came the dude that should have been cut. They put him on a practice squad. Uh, practice squad. Um, Jimmy Smith got hurt. Then they bring him in, and I'm like, man, they should have. They should have. They should have got rid of him because he looked. He was looking at Patrick Mahomes on one play, and I think it was Robinson or whoever just ran right past him. I'm like, dude, pay attention to your man. It ain't like Patrick Mahomes will bust out running like Lamar. Like, come on, man, pay attention. But Lamar, he, he had 267 yards passing. He passed over 30 attempts. Like, oh, my God. It was ridiculous. And I feel that that was the game plan, just to have them go pass for pass. But hopefully they can learn from this next week. I believe we play the Cleveland Browns. That's going to be our first go at them. So it's gonna be a good, it's gonna be a good, good game. First time seeing Odell. 
so hopefully we can get some corrections going on because uh we, we're gonna see them again i believe we're gonna see them again so everybody leave your comments kansas city played a good thing i believe we're gonna be seeing or uh, patrick my homeboy we're gonna be seeing him a lot in the future because that dude is the truth good good win by kansas city hit that like hit that subscribe see y'all next week and god bless